Here they come. They're off and pacing, coming from the outside, Ponnel Bay style. Southfield Sassy is second, third is Zero Stress Hillary, fourth on the outside into the turn, How Max Canasta. Victory cries away fifth, moving up sixth as they round the turn, going to that opening eight, straightening up the back stretch, going to the quarter mile. On the front end, it's Punnel Bay style. Her lead is short lived. Southfield Sassy moving on to the lead for Terry Gallant, How Max Canasta. Coming from the outside, third, zero, stress, Hillary, on the rail, fourth. Racing fifth is Bugtown Superstar. Victory cry in sixth. Then in seventh, West River Amber trailing the field. J.J. Dream chasing 28. And two opened it up, and how Max Canasta has gone off stride. Down the stretch for time one to the half mile. Led by Southfield, Sassy in line to Terry Gallant. Second is Ponnel Bay style. Zero stress, Hillary third. Bugtown Superstar fourth. How Max Canasta back down facing in the outside fifth. Victory cry in six. West River Amber outside is seventh. And J.J. Dream Jason is the trailer. 57 and 3, a rolling opening half mile. Southfield Sassy going to three quarters. Funnel Bay style is second. On the rail, zero stress, Hillary third. Fourth on the outside is Almax Canasta. West River Ember has fifth. Bugtown Superstar sixth. Then seventh, JJ Dream Chasing. Victory cry at the rail. Three quarters in one. 28 and 2. They're on the turn for the final time. Eighth of a mile left to go. Southfield Sassy clear by three. Ponnel Bay style is second. Third is zero stress Hillary. They're in deep stretch now. And she's a going away winner. Southfield Sassy for Terry Gallant in the PEI Colt Stakes. Second was zero stress Hillary. Bugtown Superstar rallies third. One. 57 and 1! Well, we talked about this filly in the uh, pre-race here, and Terry Gallant, uh, that trip included being on the point. That's where he wanted to be. Control the pace here, 28-2, and 57-3, and 128-2. They're rocking and rolling through the stretch, and they're all alone here, as you're going to see the slow-mo coming into, into play here. This guy's been on the runner-up. You know, she's been runner-up for so many times. Boy, if she takes the top of the podium tonight. Yeah, and again, Lee, uh, Terry made an interesting move here and an early winning move here. He wanted the front end uh, here tonight. That forced Jill to back down into the three-hole, and Jill made his move again uh, with How Matt Canasta. The horse made a break. She tends to make a break. That allowed Terry to clear to the front. You mentioned he was able to boss it right from there, and you can see home and cold here. 57-1. and one. We mentioned this horse was real sharp, good in the quig in Fredericton, excellent here tonight, and a uh, big win for Southfield Sassy. This is going to be a big ticket. Zero stress Hillary up for second. Bugtown Superstar third. 4-1-5 should be a good try in the seventh. Southfield Sassy going to the seventh race winner's circle. Bay Pacing Philly 3 by Maripan Gigolo from the Cami Best Dam Luck for Betty. On the Southfield Farms Incorporated and Claire Tallahoon. Trained and driven by Terry Gallant, the Philly Pacing to a new race win record tonight, 157 and a 150. That's Southfield Sassy in the PEI Colt Stakes. 